Coach, congratulations here at Southern Section Finals. How you feel first off? Uh, relieved. <laughs> what was going through your mind the whole day? Just the, the, such a tough division. What was going through your mind? Um, really, I just want our kids to get through healthy and compete well. And we've been so close a lot of times, um, a lot of thirds, and a, you know, a lot of top fives, and and a never a plaque. And so we're really fortunate to have some really good athletes and really good coaches that. Uh, have done well, and, and a lot of kids that came before us that laid the foundation for this, so pretty special. What do you believe was one of the biggest keys to, to, to today's success? Resilience. We had a coach pass away earlier this year that on our team. We had another coach get called out to Navy SEALs, um, and our team and their parents and the athletes just kept showing up and kept showing up, and they grinded it out this year. It was, it was well worth it. What specific events were you kind of up in the stands biting your nails on? Um, I always get nervous for the 110 hurdles, uh, Picara's running, you can fall in the 110's pretty easy. Um, it wasn't a perfect day in a lot of ways, um, we left some points out there, but um, a lot of times it wasn't good enough, today it was, we just feel blessed. Heading into Masters, what are some things mentally you're just going to tell your team, hopefully head, head, head into state with a positive note? Uh, we just want to go hit a mark and, and get to the state meet. We have uh, four kids coming back to Masters and so, um, you know, super blessed to be a head coach of a team with great assistant coaches and great